everyone. My name is Todd Rosecca, and I am the principal at Chisago Lakes Middle School. I want to invite or welcome all of you to this wonderful event. And before I kind of talk about a few items, I want to start with the stars of the show. And let's have a huge round of applause for our seventh grade band. A couple of items about the show tonight. First and foremost, please make sure your phones are silenced because if those go off, it can definitely impact our performance. Second, I encourage you to take photos, take snapshots of the performance. However, if you could refrain from videos, here's the big part. I understand that you want the video, but I will tell you a link will be shared with each and every one of you that you can see tonight's performance anytime that you want. So take photos, silence your phones, make sure no food or beverages in the theater, but most importantly, enjoy yourself, all right? We're missing one very, very important person. That is our wonderful director. So join me in welcoming Mr. Stephen Bull to the stage. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. We're very excited to put our, our hard, work, hard work and progress on the stage uh, today. Last spring, you saw the, the showcase of the ski students' growth from their winter concert, where they were just starting out and building a good foundation, to where they were playing some songs, um, a little, lot more complex rhythms, a lot more complex notes, and we're just continuing to push and continuing to progress, trying to add a few more things every concert so that we can continue to kind of build and build and play more exciting, more complex, and more fun music. Our first piece tonight is called Wings to the Mind by Brian Balmages. Um, he wrote this piece based off a quote by Plato, and the quote goes like this. Uh, uh, music is a moral law. It gives soul to the universe, wings to the mind, flight to the imagination, and charm to the life and to everything. And so we play this piece just to kind of like start our night off on a strong note and kind of let our imaginations start running wild. that I mean today maybe it's fun I don't know I think it's fun today was the first time all of these students were together on stage for the first time trying to put all of this music together our bands are split into two groups about even numbers in each and we kind of can pull a few people here and there to make it work but um, today was the day that we all got to pull it together and I think it sounds really really nice they sound really really good tonight uh, our next piece puts us into kind of the winter the winter mood it's kind of it's a piece called winter winds by Randall Sandridge um, it's not a carol melody or anything in specific, but just kind of give you the idea of kind of 
being in the snow, kind of having that magical experience. It starts out with just kind of the winds blowing and we get kind of that like, kind of you can imagine the, the snow falling around you. So here's a winter wind. That song gave our woodwinds the chance to work on trills. Um, there's a lot of exposed parts, little, a lot more places where sections can play out and be heard. We have to turn the trumpets in a section on that song. Um, there's a lot of percussion moments. Uh, a lot of our music kind of took a weather theme on um, this concert with wings to the mind, thinking about like flying and flight in the air, uh, winter winds and kind of the cold wind that blows. Deluge is a song about a, um, a hurricane and from 2018, Hurricane Florence one of the wettest tropical cyclones at, um, impacting the eastern seaboard. So this, this song kind of gives us, you can kind of hear the tension and hear kind of the, the rain um, swell and fall as, as kind of the music rises and falls. You can kind of hear that, that um, kind of the tension rising in the, in the music um, through what you can imagine of the rainstorm.
playing them on stage tonight, which is good. They're having fun and they sound really good tonight, so they should be having fun. I'm very pleased with what I'm hearing. Our next song, Binary 0101, was written by uh, Laura um, Estes, kind of as she was working on coming up with an idea for a program. I think she was talking to her, I believe it was her husband, uh, where, like, who was uh, in computer programming and talking about the computer programming language. Um, so computer programming language, if you don't know, is binary language is zeros and ones that kind of can get all the way through lots and lots of numbers and communicate lots of things. Zero, one, zero, one is the binary number for five. And at different points of the piece, you're going to hear um, about five different lines working together to you know, create the piece binary 0101. Before we play our final song this evening, just thank you all for, for coming out tonight and, and supporting our young musicians in their continued progress. Um, without your support, you know, like this, this doesn't happen. Um, encouraging them to, to play their instruments at home, work through their music, and practice their parts, super important part. Hey guys. Um, super important part of the, the process and, and finding the growth. Because um, we can do so much in class, but kind of them chasing those notes and rhythms at home is kind of the big part of, of where, where that growth happens. Our final tune tonight um, is a piece called All Is Not Calm, A Not So Quiet Night um, by Katie O'Hara Labrie. And the, the thing I want you to picture in your minds as we play this song is imagine that you're trying to um, maybe sing some Christmas carols or lullabies to your kid and try to put them to sleep, um, but your neighbors next door are having a raucous party.
Thank you all for coming tonight. Um, I hope you enjoyed our, our performance. These kids worked really hard. And we'll see you in the spring concert or sometime in between. Have a great rest of your night.